Daily vlog. It's just us two today, and uh, I want to talk a little bit about. There was an announcement that uh, Apple has two million iPhone users Who says? Uh, by the end of 2007. Who, who's announcing this stuff? Where are you getting uh, your information? I think Apple did. Oh, okay. Okay. How do you know they're telling the truth? Well, they may not be. Uh, they'd be in trouble with their stockholders if they didn't tell the truth. Uh, okay. I want to be truthful. All right. All right. Um, but Steve Jobs uh, uh, said he wanted 10 million iPhones. By the end of 2008, so not, not for himself. He let's wanted do the to math sell here. 10 million, right? Just oh, yeah, to verify, he, 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 didn't, he want didn't want them for himself. Well, yeah. So, um, so yeah. So okay. So six months of sales in 2007. There's two million. Yeah. So at the current rate, there would be another uh, two million for six months. Two million. There'll, there'll be six million by the end of 2008 sold. Wow. However, it's, uh, so that's not that's far short of 10 million. It is far short of 10 um, million. Mm -hmm. Did, did um, they have really good Christmas? Yeah, they, they both did. Yeah. So how are they going to make up the $4 million deficit? Well, there's a couple ways they could do this. Uh, way number one is uh, more countries, right? Because, you know, for most of 2007, it was only available in the United States. Yeah. It was only at the end of the year that uh, UK and France and Germany. and Germany got added. Canada? And Canada's not added yet. Canada's not added yet? I don't know. Yet? I can't remember now. Okay, Mexico. <laughs> so... They'll be adding in 2008 a lot more countries. There's rumors of China, there's talks of Japan, there's talks of Thailand, there's oh. uh, Australia, Canada. Um, I thought China already uh, had an iPhone. I imagine Brazil would be a big country they want to target. All the other countries in Europe that they you know, forgot. Yeah. Um, a lot of other high-tech countries. Israel's a very high-tech country. They, probably, oh, absolutely. they could probably sell half a million right there. So, yeah. so they'll, they'll uh, you know, try to add more countries. Um, that would be one way they'll sell more. And a lot of it, they're trying to figure out the restrictions and the rules for. Oh yeah. For oh, and different companies. They have to work with different cell companies, yeah, cell phone companies. Yeah. So, another uh, thing about the iPhone is, of course, um, uh, coming out with maybe a new model. I'd imagine for the end of the year there'll be something new in the iPhone, like a larger uh, drive. You know, it's. No. 16, 16. iPhone Mini. IPhone, iPhone Mini. Nano. Maybe that's what it. They'll start selling. The iPhone Shuffle. They'll start selling cookies called the <laughs> iPhone, and they'll sell like you know four million of them really quick in Christmas, and and be like, hey, we made ten million. I, Eve has a good idea. iPhone Shuffle. Yeah. They'll randomly call. Randomly people. call you one button. Uh, the uh, the other thing that could be uh, done is, of course, third party apps will be another big thing. Yeah. So I predict what's going to happen when third party apps come out is there's going to be a ton of niche killer apps. And by niche killer apps will be like like somebody developed a piece of software that like nurses and hospitals absolutely have to have. It's like yes. it's like this big thing and they all have it. And another one, uh, truckers will you know it's like oh a cool like mileage calculator check in system or whatever. It's like a thing for Spanish teachers like a dictionary. Well, or sure. Something. I was thinking bigger industries, but you know bigger. there'll be so there'll be these niche applications you never hear about, and, and these exist for like Palm OS. Yep. They exist for uh, like uh, BlackBerry type devices and other things like that. There's like people have these um, devices, and then they uh, and there's an app you've never heard of, and because you're not in that industry, and then everyone in that industry has that, and they have thousands sold yeah. because you know you need that. So I think there's going to be these niche applications that'll be really cool, and that are going to end up selling a lot more phones, and there'll be like an acceleration. Also, I think a price drop. I think. Uh, you know, right now, so they've got it's four hundred dollars, three ninety nine for an iPhone. If they came out with, say, a more deluxe version, you know, with more space in it, maybe a three G uh, chip in it or something, there may be room then to have a lower end one. And having an iPhone that's maybe at like the two fifty price point uh, or the three hundred price point may actually then bring a whole bunch of new people in. No, I I prefer. I don't know how much control Apple has over this. That mm -hmm. uh, the price of the phone doesn't bother me. It's the monthly price of of um, using the phone. Yes, exactly. So maybe as more plans come out, I yeah, I'd like a, a lower price price plan. Oh, yeah, plan, but who wouldn't? In the US. More carriers, but I don't think it's going to happen in two thousand eight to okay. reach the ten million. I, I I'm pretty sure that the AT and T contract will extend beyond two thousand eight. I'd rather they made just a solid that. phone that works great with whatever carrier. Mm -hmm. It's okay if it's one. I just I don't want to be messing around with right. lots of different stuff. But. Yeah. So, uh, and also, you know, more third-party websites, like, you know, that now that Google and Yahoo and other sites work really well with their applications on the iPhone, it makes it just that much more valuable to me. Yeah. So, who knows, that could, that could be um, something big. So, I think, I think it will accelerate. I think, I think it's going to be close. It's going to be really close for them to get to 10 million at this rate. But um, 
I think they'll just they'll just be able to edge that. The Christmas yeah. sales at the end of 2008 yeah. should push them there. And I think it's going to push them, hopefully, at the end of this, near the end of the year, to get some countries online that haven't really been online because it's like we need to make the sales. We need to get, you know, this country. So we'll see. 10 million in 2008, you tell me. Thank you.